welcome to coding bird this video i will show you how to make a face recognition program using python so if you want to make a face recognition program we need two different libraries so we need opencv and numpy just simply download those libraries from pythonapi.org so open just open google opencv python api and go to this link and simply there is a download process just copy this and open your cmd and just paste it i'm sure you know how to install the aps we are using i'm using pycharm ide for uh, for this program so if you are familiar with pycharm then you can use pycharm and if you Similar with other IDs, then you can use that other IDs. So if you using Python, then you have to import those libraries, Python libraries on Python. Python. Just simply go to the file and settings, and here at the six uh, here project interpreter. Then this plus sign. Click on this plus sign. And just search for open open cb just search for open cb and download that file here and install package so this way you can install open cb in pycharm we are using hard catch kit file for this for this face recognition program so we need to download the hard catch kit file just open your browser and search for hard casket classifier github and first link click here we need this file only this file so click here this is a xml file so just click here okay now click raw and now save as Okay, save and don't change, change this name. Just change the directory where you want to save this file. We, I recommend save it on the same directory where you, where you save the Python file. So I'm saving this file to my desktop face recognition Python and there. Okay, just save it. I'm already saved this file. so let me check okay here i'm already download this file so just simply download this harkas file and paste it on or save it on the same directory where your python file is so now our coding part is start so import save it to then import then import numpy then input numpy as np now set a variable face cascade face cascade cb2 cb2 dot cb to dot classifier so cascade classifier cb2 dot cascade classifier now go to your directory and copy this cascade file name so simple way just copy it and and just simply paste it here then cascade file and we we set a variable face casket and our open cv will read that casket file and give all the value and set the all value to face casket because this is the variable and then we open our web camera so we need to open our web camera so if we want to web, uh, open our web camera using open cv we have to set a variable we declare it cap 
and then cb2 dot cb2 dot video capture so cb2 dot video capture okay just like and now we need a while loop while infinity loop we have to declare two variables first one is rate and second one is n this is simple a variable you can uh, name this variable anything you like i am giving that rate and image now calf dot read calf dot read read all the webcam frames uh, other in other word our calf variable is storing the webcam video we try to read all those videos in our uh, videos to that two separate variables one is rate and other one is image now now we got that a uh, video our video from our web camera and put that video to our two different variables one is rate and other one is image or img now we have to we have to convert that video to our gray we are declaring gray gray equal gray equal cv2 dot color cv2 dot color dot cbt color okay now which video define that video variable name here image because we captured those video we transferred those videos uh, to those image and red so just type image and give a comma then then we have to convert that video so type just type cv2 dot color okay just type this cv2 dot color now so this line will convert all uh, all that captured video from our webcam to the gray scale now so detect that face so we have to detect that face from our video so so we need that hard catch kit file to detect our faces from that video so now we can just declare a variable called face face called face cascade face cascade dot detect multi scale so multi scale this is just simply here type gray and so this line so this line basically what we detect all those frame, uh, all those faces from that particular video so you because from that particular videos now 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 we need a for loop we need a for loop because we detect that face okay now we want to draw a rectangle there so that we can justify this is a face so that we can so type 4 and we need four different variables we're declaring just uh, different variables in in where in face so because we kept for loop in face now we have to draw a rectangle then simple way cv2 dot rectangle okay so we now just type image and then x y and x plus y and then x plus y and x y plus y plus sorry x plus y and w plus z give a comma then write the color code here so this is a color code 25500 this is a color code for color code so if you if we want to draw a blue rectangle there so we need a, a blue rectangle there so 5500 is the color code for blue so if we if we want to draw a, another color like white uh, white or red anything else we we have to change the color code here so there are branch of so this line will draw a rectangle and draw a rectangle where we uh, draw a rectangle this image this image this image variable stored the value of that webcam with webcam 
so we, where we want to draw that rectangle obviously we want to draw that rectangle on that particular video so we have to first define that uh, define that variable and then if we want to draw that rectangle so we need x and y coordinate and we have to plus the x and y and w plus z w plus z so that we can uh, give our rectangle shape there and this is a color code here so this line will draw that rectangle to that particular to detect that face show that frame also value to make 3 to dot i am show okay see we don't i am show which frame we want to show just the image frame because all the value stores uh, all the value is stored at that image variable so just a simple image like the and uh, now the last step is we want to close that window also we uh, we detect the face we draw our rectangle we uh, we if just set a variable just type cv2 dot cv2 dot key cv2 dot wet key cv2 dot wet key cv2 dot wet 30 and your 30 and zero x zero x if 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 e equal equal seven break what we are doing here <coughs> we are just uh, we are just reading the keyboard key and if the key equal equal 27 then the program will break what is 27 and what those line are doing this is the value of uh, escape key this is the ascii value of skip key this is the ascii value of skip key so when we are pressing the skip key then our program will automatically terminate it now just close all that windows cap dot release cap dot release and then cb2 dot destroy cb2 dot destroy all window okay our program is completed but there is a uh, one thing i want to tell you so if you want to uh, if you want to use your webcam then you have to give there a zero if you have more than one web webcam so you have to uh, you have to give that webcam number so by default if you using a laptop then your webcam uh, first webcam will be zero if you using a desktop where you put two or more uh, more than two or more than one uh, webcam then first one is one second one is two and third one is three so which cam you want to capture which cam uh, which webcam you want to use you have to first declare it and if you want or don't want to use your webcam if you want a video clip if you want to use a video clip then you have to give the video clip path here for this project i am only using the video file for this for the video clip let's play this this is my this is a video clip where we want to detect those faces those cartoon faces those cartoon faces so we just give the path we just need to give that video path so those uh, this video is also uh, on that same directory or same folder so just copy that copy that video name here give a single quotation and paste the video file name then give that format and give give a format so this video is mp4 if you to just and that video if that video is in your same directory where you are uh, your python program is then you have don't need to give a full path if you if the video is in other file then you have to give that file full path here so, we, we, so i made a mistake here first we need to change here we have to type here 5 and 
I don't give the file. This is an XML file. So just simply type XML. Just give the and change it to or change it to five. Now run that. Okay, our program successfully run. Just. <sighs> Okay, our our program is detecting that face. Just so here, it's trying to detect that face. Okay, look at clear clearly. Okay, and then if if I press the escape key, then our program will terminate automatically. So now press escape. Key. Okay, this similar process we can. Uh, detect face faces from any uh, video or we can just simply um, change it change it to um, to uh, zero change it to zero then we can uh, open our web camera and uh, detect our own face or other faces so that's all for today all the codes are given to the description box all the codes download it and and run it on your own subscribe my channel for